No more slow. the time to get off. It's crazy. It really feels like you're flying. Well, technically. plate has a nice leading edge. I'm wondering, maybe if I rigged the wing root a bit, added a safety slat here, shaved down the trailing edge, yep, this should make a completely viable semi-airfoil. Awesome! Semi-airfoil are a kind of curtain, aren't they? <sighs> wings. They're wings. For flying. Ah... Yeah, that makes a lot more sense. Are we really gonna lug that around? It looks heavy. You're right. We'll pick it up on the way back. Another one. That was the last one. Mmm, not bad. Hey, that's ready to carry this thing? Uh, we'll try, yes. Perfect. We just need a little rust to hold it all together now. This is starting to look pretty good. You okay? Laying back? As much as I can. I can see that. I was thinking. Any idea why I'm always in charge of hanging the laundry out to dry? Because I'm doing all the washing? Big deal. You just need to stick it in the machine. Where do you see a washing machine? Okay. Good point. I'll finish hanging the laundry. Boink. What's happening? Why are you scratching like that? Did you swallow some rust again? I can't see any on him. Oh! He's peeling off whole strips of skin! Stop it, Oink! You're gonna hurt yourself! Oh! I get it! He's starting to molt. Do Oinks molt? Seems like it. Oh, poor guy. No, this is natural. I don't think it hurts. Maybe, but it looks tedious. Look at him. <sighs> You're right. Let's help him. I'm gonna get my exfoliant. There you go. That's the last big chunk. I bet you feel lighter, don't you? What are you picking up? Hygrocybes. Some fell off while we were scrubbing. What are you gonna do with them? I thought they were bad for your kidneys. Not just for kidneys. But just a tiny quantity could trigger some... interesting effects. What kind of effects? You know what they take on charm for the matchmaking ceremonies? 
Is that it? I have been wanting to try that. Well, let's try these out, should the occasion arise. Thanks, Oink. Do you see what I'm seeing? But that's... See? I'm not crazy. You saw it just as much as I did. That was definitely a Heliga. It, it can't be. Could the Heliga be indigenous to Source? But then how... Shh. Okay. You have seen a Heliga. I've seen a Heliga. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think it's time for an apple brew. What are you thinking about? Huh? Why'd you ask? Dunno. You seem sullen. Was it not good? <laughs> yeah. Y yeah, of course it was good. You were in the front row. You should know. So? What's up? You seem lost in your thoughts. I'm sorry, I was thinking about the apiary. Ah, uh, of course. No, no, that's not what I meant. I was just thinking, there has to be others, right? Others like us, who love one another, trying to escape the matchmaker? I'm sure. So? Well, I was wondering, shouldn't we, like, help them? Send them a message? Tell them about Source? And how would we do that? I don't know. I I'm hypothesizing. I'm just saying that would be the quickest way to attract more attention from the apiary. Being a fugitive is one thing, but blute stirring is another. I agree, but if there were more of us, we could be better organized, resist better. Oh, please. I'm telling you, we would just get stabbed in the back. What have people done to you for you to have so little trust in them? Nothing. But who is there to help us? We had the nest. We had the coordinates for Source. Not everyone is so lucky. <sighs> I know the feeling. But there comes a time when you have to think about number one. I'd love for the world to be rid of the matchmaker too. For everyone in the apiary, to be free to live with or love whoever they want. But if I could press a button that would solve all of the Apiary's problems in one go, and pressing it would even run the risk of losing what you and I have together, I can guarantee you that not only would I not press it, but I would rip out the wiring. It just doesn't seem fair. You think it's unfair that we got lucky and others haven't? Then enjoy your luck. Don't squander it. It's the least we can do for them. They would do the same if they were you. And they would certainly not press that Bluten button. I think I would do it. <sighs> I know. That's why I love you. But that's also why I'm watching over you. Or else you'd keep running into trouble. Hmm trouble like this for example <laughs> ready to go again only one way to find out only one you must think i am unimaginative <laughs> Is this ready? Can I harvest? Yeah, go ahead. It's late. Can't we do this tomorrow instead? Sure. Sure.
okay? Do you mind if we switch sides? Hmm. Why? I don't know. I just feel like a change. Is this a trick? Ah. Uh, okay, yes. My side is all sticky because of you, and it's kind of nasty. Because of me? Do I need to remind you how the scene unfolded? No one cares who started it. What matters is who finished. You did. On my side of the bed. So we're switching. Okay. Really? I didn't expect you to give in so easily. Ugh! Your side is sticky too. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Well, what is it? I thought it would be quite obvious. It's a present. Great, I see that, but what is it? Open it, silly. Uh, that's just the shell. Wait, 
What did you do? I thought it had a nice soundboard, so I added a bridge, some strings. You said you were missing your guitar. Uh, this is so cool! Whew, I was afraid you wouldn't like it. Are you joking? It's bluting amazing! I can't believe you managed to do all this right under my nose. Is it in tune? I did my best. Ooh! How did you come up with this thing? I was tired of seeing this shell as a reminder of my mishap in the cave. What mishap? I have no idea what you're talking about. This is just the shell you turned into a guitar because you're the best lover ever, isn't it? <laughs> Are you gonna play a song? No way! I haven't played a guitar in years, let alone a shell guitar. I'll need to dust off my skills first, but soon, I promise. I'll have to show you. I found a weird door when I was on my own over there. Show me the way. Oh, it's kind of chilly up here. Yeah, we should have packed you a little sweater. Who wants some good flow? Should I open it or should you? Oh, 
It stinks in here. Uh, uh, I think I'm about to hurl. Same here. I feel like I should hold my nose and just breathe out of my mouth. But the mere thought of this smell touching my tongue. Ooh. We're going to need to burn these suits. I don't think that will be enough. Ha! I think I found where it's coming from. Oh, who would leave the refrigerator door open like this for years? This is disgusting. Uh, you? What? Did it just move? Huh? There. There, that, that just moved, didn't it? Oh, it's alive. Abort mission. I repeat, abort mission. We're out of here. gonna feel real good in our batteries. Watch out! You almost ran into me. Why were you hanging back anyway? Don't let yourself fall behind, okay? Never again. Too quick for them. I feel like she's avoiding us. Zip into the back. symbol. It's the same as on my medal. Yeah. That's what I wanted to show you. Do you understand any of this? No. And what is this? No idea. There's no button, no lever, nothing. Whoa. What did you do? Nothing. I just waved my medal and... Are you telling me that your medal is actually some kind of key? I have no idea. But in any case, it's open. So are we gonna check out the other side? Of course. Unless you have a better idea. Okay, then. These buildings are a lot more sinister than the others. Do you think that's the experimental plant my mom mentioned? Very likely so. Which blew everything up. It doesn't look so big. I'm guessing it goes deep, though. I don't understand. How could such a small drill cause an entire planet to explode? I guess it acted as a catalyst. S sorry I... I still don't understand. I'm not sure I understand it either. At best, I have a hypothesis. Whatever that's worth. Please, tell me. Okay, so... You know how the planets are set up, kind of? Uh, a big flow core with crust all around it. That's right. Irena said the plant was sourcing flow directly at the core, and that it was condensing into a solid state to facilitate transport. So that would be the rust? No. 
Actually, I'm thinking of something else. Whatever it was, something went wrong. And instead of condensing normally, the flow degraded into rust. And this degradation would have propagated along the drill path and into the core. Okay, there's no need to use air quotes every time. Sorry. So, then? Well, kind of like water and ice, if you will. The rust occupied more space than flow. When the flow core turned into rust, it expanded against the crust all around it, which ended up cracking. Kind of like leaving a bottle in the freezer for too long. And the rust leaked out of the cracks? I guess so. Otherwise, it came out of geysers, volcanoes, whatever. Uh, okay. That makes sense. Which leads me to my second question. Why do you have the key to this thing around your neck? If I knew... What was that you picked up? I'm trying to figure it out. It looks like rust, but it's a lot heavier and slicker. Let me see. Hey, it's kind of warm, too. Weird, huh? Do you think that's what they were making here? The, um, ultra-concentrated flow thing? Yes. Possibly. I'd need some time to analyze it in the nest. Do you think we'll have enough? We never have enough. How about we take a look? <laughs> Kay, check this out! Ugh, the horror. What is that? <laughs> it sings, too! Once more? No, that should be enough. Oh, look at its face! All right, we've seen everything. Sorry, Kay, but I have to bring this back to the nest. I'm not sure that's necessary. Bring it back, or I'll make it sing again. Uh, okay, whatever. <gasps> Sorry, my finger slipped. This one smells weird. Chuck it then. Are you insane? Front? No, thank you. I'm too scared to lose sight of you.
I just felt a raindrop. But the sky is still pretty clear. Sorry, my bad. My armpits are sweating a bit. Aha! Nice one. Target. Oh, no. girl. Meet my boyfriend. Bam! Your turn. Yep. Let's get it over with. And done. Okay, now shoot. You? Yep, saw that. Bye-bye. That was easy. 